Hey guys, it's Alex here again, with the Kilo 2 Papa Romeo Charlie. Today I was up at the park, um, playing around on 10 metres. Uh, I was just using the whip antenna and I, I had tuned it up here, on this particular set. All of a sudden, the tuning stopped working. Um, I couldn't tune the whip anymore, uh, where five minutes ago I could. Fiddled around, fiddled around, fiddled around, couldn't get any, any tuning at all. So I suspected that the, uh, the tuner, something had gone wrong with the tuner in the set. So what I've done, I've come back home again, and I've got another set here. Um, so to, I've devised a way to, to test the tuners in the set, pretty simple. I've got a, um, a 400 and, uh, 470 ohm resistor, uh, a 5 watt wire wound one, and, uh, and just connected it across, um, yeah, across the, uh, the, uh, the tuner output there. Yeah. And uh, I was able to tune, um, I'll have a bit of a look here. I was able to tune up on the um, on the uh, C C9 C9 position. Let's get the lead out of the way. On the C9 position, I was able to get it to tune nicely there. So that tuned up just like it was an antenna. So a bit of a mismatched antenna at 470 ohms, and uh, I was able to simply go C9, click click click, and find it, and then tune it up with the tune. And that tuned up very very nicely. That proved to me that. Um, that the tuner in this radio is working and unfortunately I tried the same thing in this one and I get nothing so I got a problem I've come back to the uh, to the set that's um, that's crook that's not um, transmitting with the uh, with the inbuilt tuner and I've put my my test resistor up on here and um, I hit the button and uh, I got no no result absolutely zero on the needle so I've gone around to the back of the set and I've said to myself, I wonder, I wonder if, if the, uh, the dog bone is faulty, that one there, the dog bone. So what I've done, I've put a, a jumper lead straight across in place of the dog bone and uh, I'm going to repeat the test. So let's have a look and see what we've got. So here we go on the set that was crook. Voila, it's fixed. The problem with the set, this set is not the tuner. It's the dog bone on the back. There you go. Uh, simple little, <laughs> simple, little, simple little test rig uh, helped me, helped me uh, cure the problem. Imagine if I would have pulled the whole set apart looking for a fault in the tuner when it was the dog bone. I can't believe it's the dog bone, but there it is. So what I'm going to do is, uh, yeah, investigate the dog bone. Okay, I've got it apart. Um, this is just a little plastic, um, um, uh, well circlip that goes in there to, to get this thing apart little plastic circlip it's very very easy to remove i pulled it apart i found i've got a circuit through it but the, i think the problem is this here was just so dirty it's black and looking in the um in the other part in here very 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 black i'll try and get a bit of light in there yeah looking in there it's it's very very black so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to polish the inside of that out with um, steel wool. I suspect that was the um, that was the problem. I think that the um, the unit had continuity on the centre pin, but I think the outside shield was um, breaking down. So there you go, to be continued. But um, that's what I found so far. With the steel wool, nice and clean there now. I wrapped a bit of steel wool around a little drill bit and polished the inside as well. Looking a lot better. Let's put it back together and give it the test and see how it goes. Uh, cleaned up, put back together and reinstalled back on the set. Uh, still using our 450, uh, 470 ohm little test rig there. We'll uh, have a look. And by the way, all this test's done on, uh, on 14 megahertz. So I've had all the dials set on 14 megahertz. So uh, let's have a look, see if we fixed it. Ah, satisfaction, isn't that fantastic? Didn't have to worry about getting a replacement, so very, very good. So two things, um, first thing I would say is, um, have you ever pulled your dog bone apart and cleaned it? Hmm, it seems they get very, very uh, dirty in there. And secondly, a uh, simple, simple little device for testing your internal tuner. Enjoyed this problem actually. <laughs> It's been fun finding the problem.